having a little pop tart breakfast. It is November 8th, so the rut is in full swing, and Bo and I are finally down here. We pulled in last night at about 1 o'clock, so we unpacked everything and got a quick couple hours of sleep last night, probably only two and a half, three hours of sleep. We're awake right now, we're gonna uh, get all of here ready, you know, obviously you can see we're getting everything out and situated, we're gonna get dressed and head to the stand, we gotta put a camera stand up at the spot we're sitting, but well, we're gonna be sitting on the edge of a cornfield or on top of this ridge and just a, a rut cruising spot, I mean bucks are always cruising there, so we're gonna see what happens, hopefully we can see some bucks, see some deer, so we're gonna finish breakfast, finish getting dressed and we'll see from the tree.
Well guys, it's a uh, pretty surreal moment right now. Could get emotional about it. But my first IO buck is down on the ground, finally after a long sleepless night and long day yesterday waiting on him and a couple hours today waiting on him. It's the afternoon now, we finally got him on the ground. It was just crazy. I shot him early yesterday morning with what looked like a good shot, but he was so quartering we weren't sure. Corey bumped him yesterday afternoon when he went in to try to see where he was at so we backed out gave him all night went in there this morning and we had a stand on this bottom and Corey figured if he was still alive for whatever reason that he'd run past it that when they bumped him so I sat there they went in lo and behold he was still alive barely and he ended up running he wasn't far from me and he ended up running by me I got one more arrow in him to, be, to end him and he's down do feel bad about the whole scenario but that's hunting it happens to all of us you know we're hunters we don't always have perfect shots unfortunately but i'm gonna get down and show you guys in quick he's an awesome buck stud eight pointer super wide just uh i mean i couldn't be more thrilled to wrap my first iowa tag around this bruiser big noggin on him we're thinking he is probably a four-year-old. Corey's got a little bit of history with this deer. Just a fun hunt with my brother to be in the tree with me and filming the whole thing and just how it happened was absolutely unreal. Couldn't be more excited. He's got flat beams that come out the sides. Really super wide. Just an unreal hunt down here. And now I'm really excited to get my brother a buck. So couldn't be more excited. 